Kia ora. Welcome back to Mea Pātai Mai. So, um, it's Lance O'Sullivan here and I have a question. This is uh, Te, te Pātai Tuaturu actually, my third question of the series. And it's from jo, Joanna Kappa, a friend of mine. Kia ora Joanna, thanks for messaging. Um, and I'm just going to go back. Joanna asked the question, hey, um, should we be covering up our skin? And uh, the, the question was, uh, should we be wearing gloves, long sleeve pants, long sleeve shirts uh, to help prevent us getting uh, the COVID-19 virus, um, I believe, Joanna. Look, my, my feeling on that is clearly, um, I might be evidencing this. Um, look, I don't, I don't think that's necessary. Uh, the skin is a very good barrier to most infections whether it be viral or bacterial uh, we you know the skin is actually a, a great um, bar a defense line unless it's broken so eczema skin infections and other inflammatory conditions can expose the skin the body to um, infections that can get into the body from the outside but as a rule we don't see a lot of uh, viruses like this respiratory viruses being transmitted through the skin. It's almost entirely through the uh, respiratory tract. So your nose, your mouth, uh, and uh, and the like. So I would say no, not a great degree of uh, of concern should be uh, made around, around the, you know, fully kitted. The difference for health workers who you do see fully kitted out is that, um, you know, like they are in a different position, right? They're, they're potentially in, in, in contact with people, like many, many infected people. So it's really appropriate that they are gloved, aprons, maybe hoods uh, or, or overalls and masks and goggles because they're coming in, they're in basically in a concentrated group among a concentration of, of people that are sick and potentially there's lots and lots of viral and, back, and disease load that's circulating around them and in the environment they're working in. For most people who aren't health workers like that, that's not a consideration I believe you need to concern yourselves too much about. That's what we know at this stage uh, that might change. The other thing is, to be to be fair, we probably don't have the enough of the right equipment to ensure that you can use the right equipment in the right way to have the best outcome and effect. So. I would say the short answer is no, no concern around ensuring that you're, you're head to toe covered. Uh, it goes back to the main issue of making sure that you are practicing really good hygiene in your home. So washing your hands, soap and water, drying them properly, trying to um, have good cough and sneeze etiquette. So you know, you're, you're, you're disposing of tissues if you're using them or you're, you're not coughing into your hand and definitely you are covering if you're sneezing or coughing and covering your mouth. Uh, I think that's going to be it's going to be the most important message to take out of this question. So, Joanna, thank you very much. And et te whanau, koe wari wari. Me pātai mai.